handicapper Steve here, handicapping the racing from the Meadowlands Racetrack here on Saturday to 20th of May 2023. Gonna look at the ninth race from the Big M, but before I get on to that, remember to please follow me on Twitter at Horse Racing Hit 5 for more selections for race courses around the world, and I mean it around the world. Let's look at the ninth race from the Meadowlands. It's feature of the evening. It is the Arthur J. Cutler Memorial. We have a field of 11 trotters going for the one mile trip, going for that $155,000 purse. My top selection in this year's Cutler, I'm going to go with the number 10 horse here, Hell Exotic. I'm going to go 10591 in the Superfecta. 10591 Super. Top selection 10 horse, Hell Exotic. This um, six year old gentleman, Muscle Hill, Ronnie Burke, trains one, Yannick Jingros in the Sulky. Most recent outing came two weeks ago on the 6th of May here at the Meadowlands in the Open One. And the horse went by ahead that day, and he left off the gate, set some really good fractions, and he, and he got the job done. So it's hard to win wire to wire on the mile, but he dug in to get the job done. 115, two fifths of the second, um, and eight offerings a season. And that was his best time of the year. A very good run. Getting the two-week refreshing from the last race. Coming here today. Going to have to overcome Y Postra. But I think he can get the job done. Two back on the slop in the open one at the Meadowlands. 29th of April. He put a second by a length that day. He left off the gate. He got shuffled back towards the half. He moved a little bit late. But he still needed something more. It was an okay race. But like I said, he needed something um that day, and then at Yonkers on the half mile, 20th of April, in the, in the uh, open handicap, went by one and a quarter lengths that day on the front and all throughout, and 153 and two fifths of a second. It was a very good, strong performance for that uh, that horse on the half mile, and then back to the mile uh, track here on the 8th of April at the Meadowlands in the open one. He won by a half a length that day. He was a little bit ranked that day early on, but he he, he got overtaken at the half, but came back and really put on a show. In 151 and two, a very good, strong performance. As the season has been going on, he's been getting better. Coming here today. Like I said, the Y poster does scare me slightly, but I think a, a good horse can overcome it. A 5 to 1, I'll use him. I think his second likeliest winner is the 5 horse. Ex it's academic for Ronnie Burke and Dave Miller. Uh, most recently, we ran at Chester on the 14th of May, which was last Sunday in the open um, in the open trot, where the horse went by one half lengths that day. He didn't get gate speed off the gate, but he got it so, um, slowly after to the quarter, and then he basically waltzed home in 151 and 2. It was a very good race that day. Um, you know, prior to that, in the open one at the Meadowlands 20, of April. He won by length that day, beating his stablemate Hill Exotic that day. He came from nowhere, a little bit wide, but he, he, he trotted home decently, 151 and 2. And then, you know, off the bench in the open, too, at the Meadowlands, 15th of April. First pair mutual run of the season. He finished third by one and a quarter lengths. He was a little bit wide, which probably cost him. They did overbet him at 50 cents to the dollar that day. I don't think he'll be anywhere near that price today, but, um, you know, he, he should get a good trip here. I like the preferred win back in November in 151 and 4. A very good place in the uh, TVG Open last uh, November. Uh, I come home in 150 and three you know i'll give him a shot here at three to one and also for the multi-race the nine horse here um ambassador hanover for scott zaran uh most recently and they opened two weeks ago first pair mutual of the season he finished second by head that day he couldn't catch hill exotic but he really ran a terrific race you know before that he had you know some good races and some bad races Put an extra the um do the uh, breeders count kind of at the at uh, Mohawk where he just had nothing. He was wide throughout and just didn't show up in the wide post draw. But if the, in the Alaraja Open at the at Lexington in uh, in October, that was a very good place. And then one non was a twenty here uh, back in uh, in September quite nicely. You know he's stepping up in a lot of class, but at eight to one, some of his miles could definitely win, especially last year. I'll give him a shot on the ticket, but I do prefer the other two before him. But to recap my selection for the ninth from the Meadowlands, now it's the Archer Arthur J Cutler Memorial going to take the ten horse. Hell Exotic, give kudos to the five horse X Academic and the nine horse Ambassador Hanover. 10 5 9 1 Super, 10 5 9 in your multi race. So good luck to all, and please follow me on Twitter at Horse Racing Kid 5. Good luck, everybody.